Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, it's Mick here. Wait to start. Um, if you caught the end of the last video, you'll have seen I was back on foot. Because there's a rain birth ashes, back that old tricks again. Pulls in to get some fuel. Thinking, you know, after we'd talk, we'd sorted it and that. So I pulls in to get some fuel, puts the fuel in, goes to start her up, nothing. Um, obviously you can't mess about in the fuel station with jump leads and stuff like that so I had to push her back where the jet wash is get myself absolutely kicked getting another van and that um, but we managed to get her started got her home I know what the problem is because we haven't if you remember in the last video as well when we're, uh, when we're connecting the, the ground wire we're having difficulty with the connection it's got to be a, obviously got to be a solid connection um, so what I've done is I've went and getting some thicker ground cable and um, some thicker connectors um, I would like to run it straight from the start I'm out of the battery I don't know how I go about that because it would need I'd need a really long bit of cable but I'm not giving in she's not going to beat this so I'm going to get cracking changing this cable again again but first I'll tell you what I am going to do doing all this and the stuff I've, I've learned on the way um, you know like now I can change the starter motor etc etc and all this stuff right one thing I have learned is that I am pretty scared of electricity um, so first things first I'm going to disconnect the battery get this all sorted out and then we'll see where we end up catch us in a bit guys Round one. Again, I tell you, I didn't notice this the last time, right? But I put this in, right? There's a little clip here, like almost like it was waiting for this cable to go along. That's me, ground cable. It's a nice thick cable, it's a nice thick cable, nice heavy connectors. Um, moment of truth, though. Let's see if she fires. First time, eh? He turn, in she goes. Jobs are good, man. Jobs are good. Try again. Hey, spot on, man, spot on. Jobs are good. Un. Oh, now to get the van sorted, get it all, because um, it's a shithole. And then back out on the road again. If it's a clear night, the night, I'll take this down the coast and show you the, um, show you all the lights in that. We'll pick all that up. And check out the Christmas lights in that down the coast then. Catch us in a bit. Stumbled at the start line I've done all that I can do But 
But I'll try again I'll try again Stay on the straight and narrow We'll meet up at the end Cramped up on the inside At the thought of losing you But I'll try again I'll try again Stay on the straight and narrow up at the end It's cold, I'm out. Um, just drove down the seafront, have a look at these Christmas lights. Not like they were years ago, like, are they? Nah. But, oh, like, you know, just keeping the van local. We've had out the day and that and yesterday, just, you know, on and off, on and off. I didn't realise how anxious it made us. Um, it's a horrible feeling. <laughs> um, especially when I'm putting them when I'm going to, because the, the fuel station when you, thing. When you conk out in the fuel station, like, Oh. Ooh, um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's all got to go on that and starts first time. So I think Wallace. I still feel so much joy when you, when, when she you. starts and she fires. It's like you. Especially when it's like yeah, yeah, yeah. She's all right. And she's then, all right, and then you get excited to go places, and then you fill her up with petrol and you get stuck. And <laughs> it's been a distraction. She's, she's working company. She is. Listen, Good. <laughs> all fine um so we are going to take a trip hopefully to beamish um yeah, you say some christmasy beamish yeah because they've, they've got some they've got the christmas stuff on aren't they? <laughs> um for you if you don't know what beamish is it's like a it's like an open air museum um you know and it goes back to the 1800s 1900s you know, it shows you how people used to live in the coal mines how they used to work have little villages and stuff like that they have old schools yeah old schools and stuff um you know, have a lot of people in costume and in character, and it's, it's a good day, isn't it? It really is, it really is a good day. So yeah, we'll um, fingers crossed. Hopefully, be taking a day trip to Beamish. Um, oh, by the way, this is Leila. That's my Leila. Hi. This is Leila. This is this is Willow's very old dog. <laughs> yeah, she's getting old now. She's in her nineties, bless her. She absolutely loves getting out in the van. She sticks a little over the roots because it's kind of keeping her in the van too long. Yeah, and she's old and she's smelly. Oh. Is that off on your propeller to finger? Both. It's cold it's the cold wrist. getting to the wrist. It's cold wrist joint. Mm -hmm. Propeller on your finger. And yeah. So it is. It's going to be like, 
I think what I should really be doing is going out there and putting my bare feet on the sand. Well, my pain levels increasing because of the cold weather coming. And for me being off the opioids, I won't touch painkillers no more. I've got to find other ways of coping with my pain and stuff like that. Now, one thing that come to was about the van was working with electricity and the, the, it was all a grounding issue. Now, one thing that with the human body, when it comes to pain and stuff like that, and inflammation, I think it kind of works a little bit like a battery. You know, the Earth's the negative part, the sun gives up all the positive particles, we absorb it all, and when we don't ground enough, it just builds up and causes inflammation, you know, and stuff like that. And it's harder to, to fight off disease, maybe, so I don't know. I just know it's that. Certain things that are in the earth. Yeah. yeah, yeah, definitely. Definitely some sort of. If you can't do that, yeah, put your feet in some salt, Epsom salt. Epsom salt. Himalayan salt, mm. ground it in, in a foot bath. But I think I would like to look more into that as well because. Obviously, I'm just. This is just like things I've been floating about, especially. With it, but when you look at it as an electric current and an electric circuit, which is what I've been working with for the van, and when you look at the body, the earth, and the energies, it's just more or less the same thing. We're in between, and I only know this because of times. I don't know when I do ground, and when you spend a good forty minutes with your feet in the ground, you know you you, you do. You feel you feel just refreshed. You feel it's easier to breathe move you, you know the pain levels definitely help it, it definitely decreases pain levels um because it often just pull the van up socks and shoes off sit inside the van and just ground for a for a good 40 minutes Ugh, i know but back to nature's healing and all that now right well we're going to head off and we'll catch us up beamish As well last say, what was it? This is us, not at Beamish. <laughs> but wow, really. We stumbled across this place, um, Cozy Arch, and... I have not got these cut on. Again, you've, 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 you've come out unequipped. <laughs> we're going to Beamish, we're going to Sloddy Sue Fucking. Language. Go on. Watching it, so it's happy new coat day for me. Happy Christmas. Sexy new coat, absolutely loving it. Nice and warm, just what we need in this weather. But wow, what a place! This is so beautiful. Look at but this is just around the corner from um, Beamish because we're we'll pulling into Beamish and it was closed. And um, so we're going to come back to Beamish tomorrow. So we literally drove up the road around the corner. Da, 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 da. 
and we're ending up in a picnic spot, didn't we? And this is like this. And this is it, it's just. I think I'm going to go and put my walking boots on. Mm -hmm. Yeah? So we're going to go and get the walking boots, right? More or less, we're going to go and get our walking boots on. Like and we'll have a wander about, yeah, because it's, um, it's nice. Yeah. It's adventure time, I like it. This is, oh, I'm loving being back out. This is what I've missed. Well, that's getting scruffy. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll catch us in a bit. So I'm walking along and more or less turns around and goes. <laughs> so I'm like, what are we in the woods, darling? <laughs> no. Water dropped in my eye. <laughs> I looked up in the train slip. <laughs> <laughs> Although it's raining, do you know what it is? It's absolutely, absolutely beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> it really is. Um, oh. 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 Happy with I can see birds flying I see children smiling When I think about All of the things that you and me could be I want to be with you both day and night To sit on the grass beneath the moonlight I know that life won't last forever But at least we can grow old together I can see the sunrise Reflecting in your eyes When I think about All of the things that you and me could be I want to be with you both day and night To sit on the grass beneath the moonlight I know that life won't last forever But at least we can grow old together
Enjoy that work. A bit of this, enjoy the view. I enjoyed the view. It was, it was a nice, nice walk, that. Mm -hmm. Honestly, it could have kept on raining because yeah. it was like this one we were going in and then it stopped. Mm -hmm. We could have kept on raining. For me, it wouldn't have even been as cold. It's not icy cold yet, is it? Would it? Wait, not that I've got this on. <laughs> Have I? Yeah. Oh no. Oh, I have as well. <laughs> I'll, I'll wipe. I'll, I'll clean it. Cause it's <laughs> I'm I wouldn't have you any other way. <laughs> you probably tripped on something and fell into a tree or something when you're yeah. recording. <laughs> like I do. Mm -hmm. I'll just do your adventure and go anyway, so <laughs> zero. Well, I, I do like to think of myself as an adventurer. Well, you look like the part now. <laughs> I felt like it came off split. <laughs> Just a pocket with my lips in there. It's turning into a girl. Are you sure it's not a lady's jacket? No, it's not a lady's jacket. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> so we're going to go back to the van. We're going to make a cuppa. And fuck knows what else. <laughs> and this is the day. I'm not going to be yeah. much, but it turned out to be. A nice sort of walk around here anyway, wasn't it? Really nice. Um, not far off a doorstep as well, so... Mm -hmm. It was, it was a nice walk. And it gives us something to look forward to for tomorrow as well, doesn't it? Yes, we've still got Beamish. Still got Beamish. Beamish. Christmas time Beamish. Yeah. Oh, Christmas time. We're even listening to the old fashioned Christmas songs on the way yeah. in and everything. And yeah, we're going to ancient land and extremely Christmas from the ages, but um, apparently not. Mm. Tomorrow is Saturday another day, so that is what is happening. On yep, so. Fingers crossed we'll get there tomorrow. Um, but I suppose it's a good time to ask us if you like what you see. Please subscribe, hit the like button, you know, comment. Would love the channel to grow. Please. Um, but for now, we're going to get warmed, dried and coffeeed up. So we'll see you next time, guys. Take care. Mm -hmm.